the state of Wi-Fi in the um, hotels and motels around, uh, certainly in Colorado, and I don't think it's that much different in other places, is universally poor, being really poor. Um, fortunately, I had my little uh, me file on, and in almost every case, and almost every place, I had to revert to using this over the Wi-Fi that was provided. In most, in most cases, the place I went to had free Wi-Fi. Uh, the, the first place I stayed was in, um, uh, in Durango, Colorado, and uh, they said, well, uh, you know, where, which room would you like them? They said, well, where's the room that has the good Wi-Fi? And they said, well, the one over there isn't all that good. And they said, there's another router uh, in another part of the uh, motel, so we'll, we'll put you in there. Well, I couldn't even get a, I couldn't even find the ID for that particular router at that place, so I had to stick with the, the one that was, uh, uh, had a weak signal, and then so finally again, I just had to revert to using this because it was it was so it was so bad. And then um, a strong signal and everything. I went to uh, I went to get something eat and came back, and I couldn't even log back onto the network. And I think uh, somebody told me that what happens with some of these chains is that they really only have their whole network. It's all you know um, almost uh, so. This uncomplicates that a lot, and uh, it, it's worked out quite well. Um, it's good too, so it uh, syncs very nicely. Sound quality is good. I, I charge it up every day. I think you, I get about um, for four hours, uh, maybe four hours out of, out of this, which is which is certainly adequate. So that was about 